bad. It would have been such an exciting day. Now, I'm never going to see Wonderland. Oh, somebody say sour grape today. If I didn't know any better, I'd say that it spoiled the whole enchilada. It's me. Well, uh, what's wrong, pumpkin? I'm not in a good mood because Kex and Pip promised to take me to Asteroid Belt Buckles Wonderland. Now they got other things to do and they'll never keep their promise. I see. Well, Pumpkin, I may not be psychiatrist, but I tell you this. Friends try to make friends happy, but sometimes other responsibilities make things difficult. There, I said responsibilities. Don't you mean responsibilities? I meant that in my own way. Satisfaction, he's good. Disappointment, not so good. Disappointment hurts. You understand this, you know? Doesn't matter, Pierogi. Like I said, I'm not in a good mood. Hmm, sometimes I never understand this either. You know one thing I'd really drown my sorrows in right now? What? One Moonstruck Milkshake, please. Coming right up. And I wouldn't worry too much about... Uh, what's... What's fun place again? Asteroid Bell Buckles Wonderland? Whatever. Hey, Tex. You finish your homework lesson? Yep. Took me about four light hours to get it done. But it was worth it. Did you take Uno to Wonderland as promised? That's you, yeah. Yeah, 
yeah, I'm impressed. Any word on Uno, Pip? Well, we couldn't help it, but we're going to need to find some way to make it up to Uno. Any ideas, Pip? I wouldn't mind talking about my feelings. Yeah, that's not helpful. You're right. It's not quite as fun as going to Asteroid Belt Buckles Wonderland, and he really wants to go there. We promised, remember? Yeah, that. We need to show our best friend somehow that sometimes a promise is something we take seriously and that we promise little and do a lot. Any ideas, Pip? Tell you what, Tex, why don't we give each other time to think? Okay. If I promise to take Saki for a walk in the park, you know I take him. But I made that promise to go to Asteroid Belt Buckles Wonderland with Pip and Uno and I'm gonna find a way to keep that promise. It doesn't matter if I try to get my homework done. It doesn't matter if Pip realizes her so-called wildest fantasies. And it especially doesn't matter how disappointed Uno is. I have a promise to keep. Don't give up the spaceship, Kex. Uh, Kex, hate to put you to trouble, but wasn't this kind of meeting held last night? Well, we have to do it again for a reason tonight. <laughs> My homework assignment's all done. So now we, let me guess, we're going to Asteroid Belt Buckles Wonderland tomorrow? Right you are, Uno. Wait, we were supposed to go today in the first place, weren't we? Yes, we were. That's true, Uno. Well, at least you weren't lying, were you? No, but we couldn't keep our promises. That's right. In other words, I was too busy catching up on my homework. And I was having so much fun on the set of the Astro Cosmetic ads. It's those kind of things that get in the way of our promises. We'll do it tomorrow. Yeah, I get it now, but what if I say yes and you change your mind again? Oh, no. No, 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 no. That's right, you know. That's definitely a wrap on the Astro Cosmetic ad. And my homework assignment, so now we can keep our promise. Thanks, you guys. You're the best. You're the best friends I've been hoping for. No problem, Uno. But it's getting late. We've got a big day tomorrow. So I don't care. Now I'm even more excited. Well, don't be. We're starting very early tomorrow. Yeah, it's a good night, Uno. Oh, oh, wait. Uh Beginner's luck. Well, guys, looks like I owe you a big thanks for three things. For cheering me on so I can win this big prize, for bringing me here, and especially for keeping your promises. Oh, uh -huh, it was nothing. Anything for our number one best friend in the whole galaxy. What you want to do now? Let's go ride that looping star coaster. Let's pick up some cat and candy. Let's go look for some clowns. We all need the clowns to make us smile, you know. <laughs> Tip and Uno.
always keep your promises. Your word is who you are. And if you break your word, people will have no reason to trust you.